To understand the carbon footprint of an electric or natural gas oven, let's first take a look at the carbon footprint for heating an average home through a Montana winter. Natural gas comes in at 8.9 tons of carbon dioxide into the atmosphere. Electric heat comes in at 29.4 tons. And a conventional wood stove is 4.4 tons. The best news is that a rocket mass heater is 0.4 tons. Just as a reference, the average American car puts 4 tons of CO2 into the atmosphere each year. This is a good time to point out that switching from electric heat to a rocket mass heater reduces your carbon footprint as much as parking seven cars. How much your oven puts into the atmosphere is depending on how much you use it. So let's change our scale to be relative to an electric oven with electric at 100%. And um, let's replace the rocket mass heater with a rocket oven. The rocket oven does the same baking while putting a tiny speck of carbon dioxide into the atmosphere when compared to electric ovens or natural gas ovens. If people are serious about solving problems related to a carbon footprint, rocket mass heaters and rocket ovens need to play a large role. If you like this sort of thing, come on out to the forums at permies.com where we talk about rocket ovens, homesteading, and permaculture all the time. Thank you.